Yes, I did. Let's How you doing? Pretty good, not too bad. Just kind of getting uh, uh, the stall stuff up and going. I'm gonna start helping to expand uh, the noodle shop. Ooh, okay, okay, yep. okay. So if you Love know that. people that are looking to uh, work at the noodle shop and eventually become manager and part, be part of my food empire, uh, yeah. feel free to let me know. And then Rick will train them and then depending on how they perform, like, you know, yeah, they might go up, they might go down. Yeah, no, hundred percent. Okay, I'll keep that in mind. I'll keep that in mind. Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Um, question tugs. Uh, apparently there's one point two mil that we're supposed to clean. Do you what? know where that is? I. Who told you that? Uh, Suarez told me, but then Ellie told Suarez that apparently, but then Bobby told me the same thing yesterday that. We have 1.2 mil that we have to clean. I think we need to find out who's even saying that, to be honest. Yeah. I, I have no idea. I just cleaned, um, because we had like 300k. I yeah. cleaned about 200, Did 260 Ellie say k of that, that. Maybe? Apparently, Ellie said that, but I don't know where that money is. No and idea. The way people were talking to me, it seemed like they seemed like I had the money. Got no idea, dude. Why would you yeah, have the no money? Yeah, I have no idea. I don't know. Like, I have the 300k that, like, I've kind of gotten through, like, our pushers and everyone. Yeah. Um, but I just I just finished cleaning that, so that's kind of out of the way. We have, uh, we have like, 250k liquid cash, another 50k dirty in there. Um, I mean, I imagine any... I would wait until Ellie, because I have, like, zero involvement with... The cleaning the money of that, yeah. Yeah, and, and the weed shit, so uh it falls into that whole bucket of like you know. Yeah. Yeah, I have no idea. It's too sounds good. For me it creates too much of a headache because the whole setup doesn't make any sense to me. <laughs> no, I feel to you. begin with. So even like the weed stuff, I just stay away from it though, like Yeah, I <laughs> I tried involving, but look, I don't know how to put this, but like, um, look, I, look, I, I don't know what to say other than like, it doesn't make any, it still doesn't make any sense to me that yeah. it's like, okay, look, I'm doing the farming, right? Um, yeah. I don't pocket like anything. It's got to mm -hmm. go to the top and then that gets split off. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Because the entire system needs to be making money, right? Yeah. Uh, but that's not how the weed is set up. Right now, the weed mm. is set up so a lot of the, the money is very lopsided. And so when that conversation was brought up, uh, it immediately turned into gaslighting. Yeah. When really, at the end of the day, it was like, well, most of that money should probably be going into Kay's pocket. And then he decides how it's cut up. You know what I mean? Yeah, no, I feel that. But, like one of my boys, he um he just throws weed, and he's sitting at like one point five exactly. mil. And he, exactly. And oh. he he only splits it with one other person, so that's three million weed destroy that yeah. they've made. And I don't think that they're, they're mashing well, out as much as we is, do as we are, you know. Yeah, the problem is that the justification is that the growers are using the money back in the gang, which is fine, but. Why would the majority of money coming in, the decision for how that money is being utilized, being made by them and not K? That was kind of what it broke down to. But yeah, no, the 100%. conversation. I just stay out of it, though. Yeah, it's better. Yeah, that's what, exactly yeah. what I do. Like even right now, like I have, I have like four four K weed I can sell. It's just I don't have the supply, nor do I want to touch anyone's supply. Yep. And be like. You know, because then that's another can of worms of like headaches. Yep, exactly. Yeah. So yeah, but, I'm um, not really sure ultimately. Yeah. Well, if anyone needs it, I'm just keeping it in our house just so that it's like. I think you know what it is. I think it. the the thing is, I don't. Th I think unfortunately, I don't know if K actually knows how much it produces. Yeah. <laughs> that's what's. I, I think that's why there's confusion. Mm hmm. Could be that. It, it honestly wait, wait. could be that because. Yeah. 
Oh my god, this local just scared the shit out of me. Oh, what you doing? Uh, moonshine. Oh shit. Bro, this guy you... like randomly like popped in front of my head. What the fuck? Hold on. Give me a sec. Let me just get out of here. If you need help, let me know. Yeah. Bro, what the fuck? Well, <clears throat> oh, that scared the shit out of me. Okay. Okay, I'm good. Holy fuck, that scared the shit out of me, dude. You're doing the deliveries, right? No, no, I was cooking. Oh. Yeah. Oh. It's so challenging because the thing that you put down is so big, right? Mm -hmm. That um, it's so big that it's hard to actually put it down anywhere. Mm -hmm. And according to Suarez, they get call, like dispatch call mm -hmm. when people are cooking. So it's oh. so much risk. And not to mention we had three of them yoinked recently, which, you know, is whatever, right? I can you pick do them this. up or no? Yeah, you can pick them up, but they start breaking over time. Um, uh, it's not okay. ideal to be picking them up and putting it down there. So there's a lot of... Um, I mostly do this because it's exciting, if I'm going to be real. Yeah. Uh, Something new and exciting, you know? It's new, exciting. It challenges. Like, I can't, like, you know, the other shit in the city doesn't excite me. Like, oh, clean the money and sell the weed to a yeah. local. Like, all of that makes me just feel, it's like, to me, that's like actual grinding. You know what I mean? No, 100%. That's, like, that's where this pure, is, pure, pure grinding. It's pure grinding. But yeah. uh, but then again, people think farming is grinding, which I guess kind of makes sense. But one's using your brain, and the other one is just like press E just to make money. There. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know, like oh cool, you get it yeah. a cop chase, but it's like meaningless. You know what I mean? Doesn't. But the lead thing is, the anything. cop chases. Other than once, I've never been in a cop chase selling weed. <laughs> Well, yeah, yeah, that is true. I'm not yeah, saying so you, that it shouldn't happen, but I mean, my, my, it's why I do the, moonshine. Comparing it's the not two, for yeah. the, the money. It's more like my big goal and we're almost mm -hmm. there is, uh, I want to do like a 10, 15 still cook, mm -hmm. like massive cook and like hold it down and all that. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Yeah. No, that makes sense. That makes sense. Yeah. That's the thing is like, I think, I think we both like the, because the thing is like, for example, the weed shit is, it's, it's easily accomplishable where the moonshine stuff, you need to use your brain to, to yeah, hit to the set finish up line, a full you know, farming operation. You got to invest in it then you got to mm -hmm. figure all that shit out. Like it's a lot of time investment and it's not for those who are looking for making the biggest buck. I mean, to be honest, like, that's kind of, I think, maybe part of why the weed is a little rough in my mind is, like, I wish it led to something, you know what I mean? Yeah, like, something else. You push it's enough, like... you can do big, like, weed run or something, like, you're aiming towards other than mm -hmm. increasing the bank balance. Yeah, like, sense. to me, once you, once you have, like, a warehouse growing weed... Then you're making bigger bricks for like big, 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 like a truck test throws or something, you know? Or yeah. like something, something other than just sitting on a corner for 14 hours a day, making 300K. Yeah. You know, just selling weed. <clears throat> yeah. yeah. Yeah, that is true. Yeah, yeah, that's, I mean, maybe it comes someday, but like, to be honest, that would be the sickest. Yeah, um, imagine you have like a little cargo truck filled with weed yeah. that you have to like, you know? That, and that's something you're To you me, protect. that's like meaning, you know? Like, yeah. 
increasing like you know and that's kind of where like you know i i don't know yeah but okay uh all right patar i'm gonna go uh is there anything else yeah if you run into anyone who's like interested in uh doing food stall stuff uh let yeah. me know sounds good we'll do and if you need anything let me know will do all right patar bye-bye talk to you soon peace 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 peace